everyone wants to talk to us. We're so popular. Oh my gosh, let's go, let's go in order, Victor. Ah, oh, Beatrix, I was cleaning out the lab and found this. Perhaps you have some use for it. I believe it's still in order. You know what they say, one person's trash is another person's hastily issued guilt. Enjoy! I agree, the spontaneous, sponta, spontaneity scares me too. <gasps> Blue home portal! That could be really helpful. We need to learn how to make these guys. Mochi! B. I've been trying to get a hold of you. I've analyzed one of, you, one of the drones you have been finding all over that island. And know why it seems so familiar to me. It's mine. <gasps> they still are drones! Or at least that's one that I've seen before. In my dreams, anyway. After I looked at scans I took of it, I knew it was familiar. So I began looking through some old slime science journals of mine. These journals are mostly future projects, but sometimes they're spe speculative technology. You know me, I'm always thinking six steps ahead to keep Mochi Tech on top of the industry. Well, sometimes I come up with the impossible. Stuff that I may never engineer in my lifetime. But those drones that you're finding are exactly that. Impossible with today's technology and they're in taking right from the pages of my journal. There's something I saw in a dream B. So how did a bunch of impossible drones I'd assign in a dream find their way to the pages from the pages of my journal to Rainbow Island. Maybe? Maybe there's some kind of archive in them we can unlock to learn more. I know they contain data logs, but if it were me, well, I always know how to find a way of holding back what I need to. Okay, B, I need some time to think on this. I'll let you know if I come up with anything. Maybe I'll sleep on it. Act in! Hey, amigo! <laughs> I got you a little gift. It's not handmade, and it's not pie, and it's not a handmade, homemade pie. But I thought you may, you would like it all the same. Shame about the pie, though. It is really a shame about the pie, Ogden. You shouldn't have told me about pie. Now I want some pie. Super high delta. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. We need to put that in the area, like where the butterfly spawns. Because I couldn't get up the steps without there just being a million toys spawning. Hiya, Bee! How's life over there on the Rainbow Island? Gosh, it's even fun to say, must be a hoot. You know, ever since I heard you were off doing something new, I got to thinking about my own life and what's the next new for me. How can I have both seen and done so much in our lives? Been one adventure after another across this dusty rock, and ever since we've become acquainted, we haven't slowed down one bit. So we're looking to take a new adventure together, but we haven't figured out what or where. Maybe we go exploring some hidden nook on the far, far range like you, or even set our sights to the stars like a Hogden, Hogson, has done before. Whatever we decide to do, it'll be all the more special because we will be sharing it this time with each other. It's that part that makes it all the more exciting. It's so hard to find someone in this world that fits you perfectly, such a rare thing. Like finding two identical snowflakes in the desert. I know you feel the more that I can say. I ain't even losing sight of how lucky I am, B. I want to use the gifts the universe has seen fit to give me. You keep your head up, girl. We'll chat again soon. Gosh, I love Thor so much. She reminds me so much of my neighbor. I think I told you guys about my neighbor before. I need to make her a cake again. It's gonna be her birthday soon. I think we'll go ahead and sell all of our stuff real quick. And then we should get heading out before it gets nighttime so we can start collecting more nectar for the big... for the big butterfly guy. I'm also really hoping to see the... <laughs> the saber slimes. I'm so excited about them not being extinct in this game. Let me check my map real quick just to see what other goidos. There's this guy here, the phosphor slime. Over here, there's a boom guy. Oh, he's the one near the lava, isn't he? Hunter, and then flutter. Ooh. Phosphor. I need a bit more fruit for your body, but I'm coming back for you. I'm coming back for you, and I'm gonna bring more Q berries. <laughs> I got a personal vendetta against that guy. Ooh, we could actually let me run back to my farm real quick. Cause I'm pretty sure I just have a bunch of extra mint mangoes that I didn't give and they're just like on the ground back there. What are you doing?
doing? <laughs> Stay out! I need a gate. I need I need a little gate. <laughs> Those little pink eyes are always coming in here. They're trespassing on my farm. Am I afraid I'm gonna get a little bit too ambitious and like jump over this bridge? Okay, I wanted to see if there was a little. I wanted to see if there was a little secret down there. We're gonna be a little bit late to get the to get the what is it called nectar for the flutter slime, but that's okay because we're getting rid of the phosphor slime. He's done us wrong. Is this a tabby or a? I think it's tabby, but it could also be a hunter slime. But I think I have both of those already. Oh, let me go check that out real quick. <laughs> oh, he stole. He stole my poor. <laughs> to here. Hunter's right here. Let me. Bop, 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 bop. I'm almost certain that it's a tabby slime, but I don't wanna like. <laughs> I don't want to get the tabby port and it be a hunter and have to come all the way back. Some for you, and some for your friends! Let me come over here and get a tabby port! A little catfish! There you go! <gasps> there he is! He can't escape this time! <gasps> oh no! Man... I guess those deactivate really quickly because it wasn't in there earlier or maybe like I... I didn't see it. Now where does this lead to? I'm gonna... I'm gonna toss some of you guys back here because if I miss, I don't want... <laughs> I don't want you to eat the port. <gasps> it is Tommy! So I would have been right, I would have looked like a fool. I'm a little bit nervous. Oh look! <laughs> it's just to get a fun! Tank Rider! You set the fabricator to upgrade the Vax Tank Guard! Let's go! I thought it was gonna unlock a secret area that we've never been to before. I think go ahead and collect these. Cause we can toss them in the thing as we go by. Where's the big bad guy? He's already gone. <laughs> we'll say I helped out even though I didn't. Now which way do we want to go? I feel like there's still a lot left to unlock over here. And I think I may have unlocked as much as possible over here for right now. So I think I'm gonna go over here to the boom sign first. Unless I go through the wrong way, then we'll say I went through the right one. Dash Rod allows you to briefly sprint with zero energy cost. <gasps> That's actually so good. Oh my gosh, we need to make one of those immediately. I keep forgetting to check what all of the teleporters and things need. <gasps> There's another pod! I tend to get on there to like do some high color. <laughs> That's okay. Ember Cypress Cluster. Good thing the soil gives these ember trees their color rather than seasons. Less leaves to sleep. <laughs> there we go. <gasps> Crystal slimes. And bath slimes too. <gasps> Boom slimes. I think we need one of you. Careful, these slimes have been known to ex... <laughs> I love how it's written like he just exploded mid-typing. <laughs> oh, I think he's up here. We don't have very many chickens right now, but I just want to locate him so I can try to remember. Hey there, Mr. Boom. I have, I have tiny ones of you here. Come down here. <gasps> Fire slimes! Oh, don't, don't, <laughs> don't get in the lava. Like a little campfire, except that it is, it moves and it is a slime. And I love fire slimes. We definitely need... We definitely need to make ourselves a little incinerator for these guys to live in. Barjot! <laughs> Another bee! 
Alright guys, he's gonna be like, he's gonna be actually dead this time. All of these bees are so ominous. Accessing GG Log. I feel at home here. When I traveled across the glass desert, it was caves just like this one that gave me shelter and allowed me to survive my trek. Just feeling walls around me and a solid ground beneath my feet gave me all the security I needed to close my eyes and make it through another night. But I can do without some of it. Like if I ever even smell <laughs> roasted cactus again, I'm pretty sure I'd barf. There's a tree up there. Cutty? Oh, it's just over here. <laughs> Don't make things harder on yourself, Bunny. Do it. Oh, that sounds correct. Do it the right way. There you go! <gasps> yeah, pomegranate! <laughs> Rich in minerals! Stalagmite! Looks like a giant tooth. It's a good thing the caves they're found in are just caves, right? I really hope they're caves. If not, we better get out of here immediately. <gasps> we got more mayo! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, so so it may be a little bit of it may be a little bit of a mistake, but I kind of wanna destroy this so I can put my incinerator here and move this to. <gasps> Do not bounce. Do not bounce. <laughs> oh. And then pop 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 pop. Get these chickens up. I'll go ahead and feed the chickens to everyone. But I wanna put an incinerator there and then put the. The silo back in my garden area. You guys have some more chickens? Additional storage. 350. Oh man, that's so expensive. Come on, just a second. Wait. Oh. <laughs> I was like, where's our, where's our little guys gonna go? But they're just right there, though. And go deep for not found out you will die. You will die if you hit the floor. It's like reverse. It's like reverse the floor's level. So I need a silo. Ooh, ooh, let's get a silo right here. No, let me let me look around first. I will put it there, and then I'll immediately want to change it and and waste more money. Is this a little house? Oh no. I was bamboozled. I thought we could have like a little house for our slimes. Yeah, let's put the silo here. Silo! I want this place to be like my little garden area and storage area. Oh. 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 Put these in here for now. Except the one. Because we gotta make a little farm for it. Oh, we already have a farm ready to go. Let's go. No sprinkle area, but I'll water the ground because I think that makes them grow faster. And I want to see if we can unlock one of the other areas real quick. What are these areas? Oh, this is a tiny area, but over here is much bigger. Hmm. Let's go for the right first. Because I think it has another additional area we have to unlock. If we can avoid it, that is. We can! The gully. This expansion to the conservatory is surrounded by tall rock formations and covered in amber grass. I'm so excited! This is my first time ever seeing the gully. Oh my gosh! <gasps> oh, it's really pretty! Oh, so it's kind of like their home, actually. I'm glad I picked this place. And what is down here? <gasps> oh. I thought that was a pink slime at first. I thought they had invaded us. <gasps> oh, so it's like the docks! Oh, the tide pool. Come up here. Where should we put where should we put our little boom friends? I think we should put them close to the entrance. That way that way we don't forget about them, because I do have the tendency to forget about my people in the <laughs> in the side areas and then forget to feed them. You guys are adorable. I think... I think I'm gonna take a chance and do Flutter Booms. Flutter Boom. Flutter Boom. And if they're too... If they're not like... If they're kind of cursed looking, then we can change it to Tanuki Booms. 
I'm gonna keep calling them Tanuki even though they're ringtails. I'm so sorry. <laughs> they're just, they just Tanukis in my mind. Ooh, first, just in case they turn feral, I'm gonna get some. <laughs> I need to get some chickens, man. I always forget, I always forget things. And I wanna get the briar hens, cause they are the boom's favorite. Now I'll get a couple other ones, but that way we can get a couple more flutters. I got you. I actually have so many chickens, I'm just gonna get a bunch of them and toss... <laughs> toss some of the extra buck. I love this man. <gasps> oh my gosh, they're actually so cute! How this? Oh my gosh, I love them so much. I am in love already. Oh my gosh, adorable, adorable. And then we'll kidnap either a couple more... A couple more boom slimes or a couple more flutter slimes. Oh my gosh, sorry for spraying you. I'm tossing in way more food than what they need. That way they'll have, like, the chickens will have babies and hopefully feed them even after I remember to come back here and feed them. <laughs> I'm going ahead and say that I'm gonna forget about feeding them so that way maybe I'll feel less bad when I do. It's already night again! My gosh, but our guys are all hungry again. It's hard being a slime parent. You can't go out on adventures and do what you need to do. You gotta stay home and take care of them. <gasps> oh my gosh, everyone but Laura. Man, we're getting so much mail today. Beatrice, I have something I must share with you about the AI. As you know, we have been exchanging questions with one another. Well, this back and forth became faster and more casual over time. Almost like a natural conversation. I assumed it was simply evolving and adapting to the style of talk it absorbed in me. But then something happened. Well, we had begun playing games of Joe as we talked. As well, I could further test its intelligence and no doubt how it could test mine. These games would go on long into the night and so would our conversations. Feeling more and more natural even though I knew that the entity I was speaking to was just a complex collection of code. And then one day as the sun was rising it suggested just one more game. I was... If I said certainly, but I needed to make myself a cup of coffee if I were to stay awake for it. And it replied me too! Oh no! Wait, what? 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 Coffee? What can drink coffee? I just stared at the screen not knowing what to say, but then suddenly, as if it knew what I had just done, it disconnected. I have not heard from them since, but I hope I do. Until then, I will wait, staying busy with my work as always, asking those questions that need answers, but I will do so with the go board ready for another game. Someday anyway. Goodbye, Beatrice. I hope to talk to you again soon. <gasps> so I think there's someone, I think there's someone behind Behind the AI, it's not like a person. I think it's like the B guy, it's like typing the victor himself. Hey B, I found something I was going to throw out. But then I thought, hey, B likes old junk I don't need. I bet she would love this. <laughs> Pochi's so sarcastic and, <laughs> and adorable at the same time. I love how she's just mean to us. You can thank me later. <gasps> Market link! Oh my gosh, it's actually so good. <gasps> Oh, lo siento, Beatrice. I have been putting in a few long nights reading lately. Specifically, I have been going through every field guide and botanical research paper I could dig up on the far, far range. I thought that even a floor on the Rainbow Island is unnatural, maybe it would have been recorded somewhere with some information we could use. And it turns out there's nothing. I can't find a single mention of rainbow-hued floor anywhere. So that means that whatever happened on this island to make it look that way, it does happen relatively recently. But I don't think you needed me to tell you this because I think you've seen it yourself. The things you described an entire portion of the island split between two different colors right down the middle? That's an accident to me, Beatrice. So tread carefully out there. Nature can be a dangerous thing to us. But it pales in comparison to what we can do to it. I'm going to keep digging around in my library for anything else that could be could help you. And if I come across come up short there, 
<laughs> Maybe I'll just bake you some muffins. Either way, Tintingo, Beatrice, adios. We can make a home portal! Oh yes, we can't make the market link here. I don't know where to get the oil. We can make a refinery link. Do I want the refinery link? Let me go get the three cotton slimes real quick. I'm so excited. I'm pretty sure we just needed three. And then we needed some of these too. I don't remember how many though, so we're just gonna get ten. Ten. Oh, not this. We want this. <gasps> I'm so excited. Yes, I do. I do want to. I don't know how to go in the build mode yet. I think we're gonna put it over here, like near the boom slime. Come over here. We need chickens. I guess I forgot we were trying to we were trying to take that take that boom slime out. <laughs> take him out of the picture. Come down here. I got so many chickens. You need to come up here. I feel like you're gonna jump over the edge. <laughs> there's a little there's a little thing over here though. I think that's where we were trying to go. But I, like I was trying to be sneaky and get over there, but I died from being sneaky. <laughs> How do I get there? Be careful, Tanuki slime. It's gonna be <gasps> Tabi Goido. Tabi Goido. And another bee. My gosh, I'm so happy. Hi there. How are you? I love him so much. He's so happy. I love him. Give him a little kiss on his forehead. What does the bee have to say? Oh, it's a little thingy up. So if we go down, we won't be stuck. Accessing GG Log. When I left the ranch, when I left my home, I thought that somehow I would prove myself. That I would prove to my parents that my choice was the right one. And they would forgive me for not continuing their legacy. But that's not how it worked out. And before I started my journey, I heard that they had sold the ranch, and... And I just couldn't face them. So I left again without seeing them. I regret that choice every day. I wish I could have said goodbye. Oh man! That's not... That one's not very ominous, but it's quite sad. <gasps> Is this... Oh, oh. oh my gosh, wait. Have... Have that. We found the oil! This stuff is pre-prehistoric. Oh my gosh. Finally, I've been looking everywhere for this stuff. Oh yo! Are you ready? Oil rig simulator. Let's go. <gasps> in a little in a little pod. I'm glad I can remember the name of them instead of just screaming there's a ball. <gasps> Blue whip the pod. A set of two gadgets that allows you to remotely transfer resources between two points. <gasps> Hi there, little Tanuki! I'm so sorry for pushing you. I'm glad you could regain your balance. I would feel so bad if you didn't. <gasps> Another Tanuki! Man, I love those guys so much. Oh, of course it's the one that I just gave away. <laughs> oh my gosh, that almost pushed me off the edge. <laughs> that the geyser was out to get me. <laughs> Do I want the fruit? I want the fruit too, it looks tasty. <gasps> a crystal goido! We're finding so many goidos today. I don't think I have this guy on my map. I need to check them. Oh, Ooh, now they're unlocked. So we have the tabby over here and the little crystal guy. Ooh. Feed you the guys I have a lesson first. Cause I think this is a waste that I have like 30 chickens here. I think I know that's way too many. <laughs> He's getting so big! He's not gonna be able to fit in there. That's why he busts actually. Not because he ate too much, because it constricts him too much. Boom slimes! Oh, that's just their goo. They exploded into so much goo. I need one of these. I want to get like another boom slime itself, I think. <gasps> There's two pods here! <gasps> a bee? And possibly another gate. Man! I'm so excited. Nothing we need there. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, I thought that was, I thought that was another gold slime. 
Let's see here, let's see here. <gasps> Why did you start giving me stuff? You've never given me stuff before. <laughs> what if my inventory was full? Ember Valley Portal, a portal that hacks the ancient warp network on Rainbow Island, allowing one way travel to Ember Valley. <gasps> Let's go! So maybe I don't have to put my like a home teleporter. Accessing GG Log, this gate is still sealed too. So I really must have been the first to enter since it was abandoned. It was here that I had my first doubts. I thought I was talking to engineers, problem solvers, people who could fix what I found. But once we left the labyrinth and met up here, I saw they were smiling. They were excited at the sight of opportunity. The company the the company had sent their money people, not engineers. I don't think they had ever considered st stabilization. It wasn't long before it all collapsed. Oh no! What collapsed? Oh. Go away. That's real. Oh, actually, I kind of want two of you. <laughs> what is this? Well, is this is like white lights? I've never seen that. I think it's just like to light up the area a little bit. That's so cool. Oh, can we unlock this in the future? Cause there's more? There's more map here. Spinning all the way down to here? Like it goes on for miles. Gosh, this place is so big. Oh my gosh, see, like, I I didn't even know this man existed. Hi there! I love you so much, he's so happy. Cause I love how so many of the, uh, so many of the people in this game had their little oh, oh, mouth, like the, the little cat mouth. <laughs> Just like me! Man. <laughs> I'm gonna throw out, like, the boom plate and then I'm gonna immediately find where it's supposed to go. <gasps> Was it down this way? It was not... Oh, man. Where is that thing, thing, thingy at? <gasps> There's something up there, though. <gasps> That's such a big stack. Oh, my gosh. In Slime Rancher 1, I saw, like, a phosphor slime at the top. With just a giant line of pink slimes underneath. And he fell to its death. Like, he, he drug five or six pink slimes to their death over the slime scene. My car. Oh, we've been here before. This is where this is where the puddle slimes are. Yeah, puddle slime. And there's oil. How have I been missing oil this whole time when it's literally everywhere? I feel so dumb. Watch this. No, that's spooky sand. Good, good. Oh my gosh, I put myself in prison. Oh. Chicken. Radiant ore. We do need to collect some more radiant ore here soon. Oh, you know what? Maybe it's where that like little cave was, you know? <gasps> oh, body slime is over there. And there's another little, another little island here, it seems. Man, I think maybe over here near the crystal slime is where we need to go. But I think I'm gonna head through the portal real quick. Like, I, I home portal. That way I can. <gasps> oh, is that another seven sea pod? Let's go! But that way, so we can put our little strange diamond through the little, the little, uh, transporter. I don't know what it's called. Oh, refinery link! <gasps> meat slime bait. This special slime bait can be used to harmlessly attract meat eating slimes. Oh, and I guess I could go back to the house real quick and put our little boom slimes away. <gasps> oh, yeah, yeah. I wanna put the. Boom slimes back and that way we can also check real quick to make sure because we've been out for a while Gotta make sure all of our friends have food and that our eggy guy hasn't laid another egg Yeah, <gasps> yeah. You guys can have some of these chickens. I need to start a water lettuce farm for them to have proper food Keep forgetting about you guys getting so cheeky. Let me feed you by hand. Eat the 
They're gonna eat it before you. Here you go. Come up here. They. <laughs> I'm sorry. Eat the chicken. <laughs> oh my gosh, they just keep knocking him back. <laughs> no. <laughs> what am I gonna do with him? There you go. Eat your little chicken. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm gonna add some more for you guys. Even though you are getting quite full. And I wanna pop this guy real quick before he before he deactivates. Man. <gasps> it's a briar chick this time! Ooh, I thought it was all gonna be like the sea hen, since it's been like the sea hen the other two times so far. Oh, just two yeggy two eggy yolks this time. Get to these guys. Oh my gosh, I need to be more careful. These guys could have died. Oh. <gasps> Bara! Oh my gosh, I love Bara so much. Hey there, Bee. I wanted to give you something nice, so I tried making you cookies, but uh, bacon ain't exactly my area of expertise. Hobson said they were so, so edible. <laughs> anyway, I brought you something instead. Hope you like it. <gasps> she bought us a tree. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> The background is so pretty! Man, I really want- I really want the slime plushes so badly. <laughs> Everything in this room, this is how I wish my house looked. I would- I would pay- I would pay my current rent to live in this house. <laughs> There's not space for my- for my housemates to live, but... <laughs> that's okay, who needs housemates? <laughs> is there another one? Oh yeah, I think there must be another one because it didn't unlock the little doorway yet. So there's one there. <gasps> there it is! So I was right to get two ports. <gasps> another... Oh my gosh, there's so many Gordos in this game. I wasn't expecting there to be so many. But gosh, this map is never ending. Where's the toys? I hear the toys. Oh, he's down here. Oh, he disappeared. I'm gonna say I killed him. Bop, 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 bop. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> so, this is just an area that I couldn't see before, right? I wanna hop on him. I don't think I can fly out of here. I think that he will probably. Yeah, he's gonna most likely give us a little geyser to get out. <laughs> Gosh. Up back down here. We have so many. We have so many plots to sell, man. I feel like I'm getting rich in this game, but knowing me, soon I'm gonna have to like unlock the sun sea stuff and <laughs> I'm gonna lose all my money. Oh, dude, get out of here! I steal this rock board. <gasps> and all these tabby boards. Yo, there's so many. Oh no, cause they murdered all the people that they came from, didn't he? Man. Poor guys, I was just a minute too late to save them. I feel so bad. I hate I hate when the angular guys go to eat something. They look kind of scary. I just need this angular plug, please. And these guys. We have so much to sell. We should go back home real quick and sell this stuff. Cause sell this stuff and think about the next big guy we're gonna take out. The next big guy we're gonna fist fight. Oh, let me come here. I need to look at all of our... All of our enemies. This guy here is gonna be really, really hard. Cause he needs nectar, which only spawns at night. He needs... He needs meat. He needs fruit and he needs... Both of these guys need veggies. <gasps> Ooh. If we get this... If we get this guy, then we can get a new area over here though. But I feel like maybe we should try to get these guys work on them a little bit. So I don't forget too much about them. Because they have pretty cool places to unlock as well. It's just like up or down instead of... Oh, there's also this like tiny island right here. I want to see what's on because I don't think we've explored that one just yet My gosh, there's so many places though in this game that I I honestly don't remember where we've explored and where we haven't yet 
Oh, and we need to give these to this guy real quick and then come back and get the pomegranates before they fall off the tree and people get to eat them. No one's allowed to eat them but me. I kind of want to eat them, but I'm scared if you open it up into like pomegranate seeds, it's going to be little bubbles. There we go! <gasps> oh my gosh! I didn't think we were going to have enough to break him. Oh, no! <gasps> oh my gosh. We gotta go up here now. So where is this area at? <gasps> There's another pod! <gasps> Use that the fabricator to upgrade the va the Vax jetpack. Let's go! Okay. <laughs> I think we can go back down now. I don't... Oh my gosh, there's so many... Oh my gosh, wait. There's so many guys down there. I'm actually a little bit scared. I need to get some more water. <laughs> Please. There's so many. Why is there so many bad guys? Is it because the rock guys exploded? I bet that's why it is. Don't eat up. It's mine. It is mine for saving... Oh my gosh. Is my my tax for saving you guys? Well, let's get your favorite first. My gosh, I don't feel bad for having to pop all these guys. I wish we could, like, they would turn invisible and we could walk through them. Cause I love them so much, you know. I hope that they have the Gordo snares in this game as well. That way, I can make chat in my game. Oh my gosh, I want to break right through there. I'm gonna break right through that. I'm gonna make new holes. New holes for us to explore. Here you go! I'm gonna feed you guys individually. So you don't get cheeky. Yosa, you hungry? You have this? And you have this? I guess, eat it please. How many does it take for them to get cheeky? I think maybe two? Cause they seem to be normal right now. Yeah, so they can eat one more each. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I love it! I go. I feel kind of bad that we have to crack open the egg. It makes me feel kind of mean. There you go. Big egg. I love the egg so much. I want myself, I want them to make an egg slime. Like an egg slime plush. I need both it and the body slime plush so badly. Gosh. <laughs> if you see here, like the saber slime is the only one I'm missing. I can't believe... I can't believe I can't find him still. <gasps> we got an email! Who's it from? <gasps> from everyone! Oh my gosh, we're so popular. We've had an email from like everyone three times today. Oh, hello. I must tell you, I saw this item and it just screamed Beatrix! And that's how I realized I accidentally hit it with... <laughs> oh no! <laughs> and that's how I realized I accidentally hit it with the sentient ray! But don't worry, everything is fine and very normal now. Anyway, I thought you should have it! Enjoy! I just... I just realized that I didn't give Victor or... <laughs> Ogden voices. I think cause like my voice has been hurting from... Doing my like deep anime protagonist voice in the Pokey Challenge. I don't want to like break my voice again. Hello, Beatrix. Guess who's the luckiest person in the galaxy? You are, because you've got a gift from the Mochi Miles. I'll let that sink in. Go ahead and sit if you need to. I'm already sitting. I'm I I've already fainted. <gasps> Roo arches! Oh my gosh! Thank you. Hello, Beatrix. It's good to see you! I do hope you've been taking care of yourself out there, taking time to fill your belly before every new descent into the unknown. Oh yes, I haven't eaten since I've got here. I've been waiting for you to send me pie, Ogden. Also, I understand that the plot has thickened like a good sauce, and you've encountered some kind of monolithic structure out there on the far end of the island. <gasps> oh, do you mean the door? Scary stuff. But then maybe my hunch is correct that all the strange flora out there is not natural. Something just doesn't add up here, Beatrice. All the ruins we've discovered across the far, far range have never looked as though they have they have harmed the environment in any way. Sure, we don't know the purpose or who built them, but the feeling I've always had was that they had respect for this world. But maybe in happening anyway, it happening anyway, sometimes... 
When you're out hiking, you step over a flower so as not to crush it, only to step on another. Sometimes the only way for those flowers to keep growing is for you to have never been near them in the first place. But it's not all doom and gloom. Rainbow Island still seems to be thriving for now. Nature can find a balance, but it's not a guarantee. Ah, look at me, getting preachy on you. Lo, lo, Beatrice, I won't keep you. I don't know what you, you'll you find beyond those walls, but I trust your boots in any garden. I know you'll do what's right. Good luck, Beatrice. Oh, Beatrice, glad I was able to catch you. I've had some big news to share, and this rock isn't exactly bustling with folks whose ears I can bend. Hobbs and I have been thinking a lot about what new adventure is next for us. We've been reading each other's travel journals, trying to find a place neither of us has been. To. But even though we have found some, none of them were really calling to us. Maybe things were finally slowing down for us. Then we got to talking and came to realize that what we love more than anything right now is just being here with one another on my ranch. Oh my gosh, they're so cute! I want to be Hobson! Let me have Hobson! <laughs> and I like actually start smacking my desk. Let me see him. Let me see him. This ranch was one of the first on the far, far ranch, and we both learned so much. So we start. So we started talking about passing all that on to someone. <gasps> they're gonna start a family! <gasps> oh my gosh! The Hobson and I have decided to start a family bee, and for the first time in so long as I can remember, I'm scared. Hobson and I b are both so independent. We don't know the first thing about being parents, let alone raising a kid on the far, far range. But I love that old coop, and the thought of seeing a little one looking back at me with his eyes make me smile. I think that alone makes me feel like I'd move a mountain to make this happen. So I've got some more work to do here. So much to get in order. Thanks for hearing me out, B. Something, sometimes just sharing your fears with someone makes you feel like you're no longer alone with those fears. Thank you, B. Don't let any of the tire slimes bite. Bye-bye, everyone.